Hey guys, I'm Rita and in this episode I will show you how you can post journal on free agent accounting software. So if you need to make correction or adjustment to any of expenses or income codes or any other codes available on your chart of accounts, then this is a way how you can do. So firstly, I'm looking at profit and loss statement and I noticed that under travel I have posted my parking limited invoice for 1650 and I actually want to mo move this one to office expenses. The way how to do it is to post journal. To post journal you need to go to accounting and click on journal entries. Here click on add new journal entries, add journal description, so I will call cost adjustment 07 2022. Select the date when you post this journal and every journal should have minimum two rows. So in my case, I want to move from um, travel. I can add additional information. Okay, and because costs are originally in debit section so to remove it i need to post 1650 into credit section or place in credit section so i need to balance it off to zero and now i need to select other side where i want to move these costs if i have moved out from travel in my case i will have to office uh, office costs okay and i can copy the same description and add there and as you can see, there is difference of 1650 showing because it's not balanced journal yet. So 1650. And now I have both sides balancing and there is no difference. And once you have added all information, click create journal. So now you can see your journal entry below here and there is information provided for 1650 going out from travel to office costs. Now, if I go to my reports, I look at my profit and loss statement and I look at travel there is no transaction posted there and if I click on office costs I can see that parking costs have been to add have been moved to admin costs so this is a way how you can make corrections or adjustments on free agent accounting software simply telling how you can post journals this is not only for corrections or adjustments for example if you need to post wages journal just remember you can have multiple rows, but debits and credits should balance. If you have any questions or require any further advice, feel free to reach out to me.